Thailand's Prime Minister Prayut chan ocha has announced his retirement from politics. He served as Prime Minister for nine years for the military-backed United Thai Nation Party. He will remain caretaker Prime Minister until the new coalition government is formed. And the 69-year-old expressed his gratitude in a Facebook post, thanking the Thai people for their support. Mr. Prayut also lauded his party's efforts in upholding the principles of loyalty to the nation, religion and monarchy. The former army chief's UTN party lost May's election, securing just 36 of 500 House seats. His government's handling of the coronavirus pandemic and the economy are said to have amplified calls for Mr. Prayut to step down. May Wong joins us live now from Bangkok for more on this. May, the election results, they saw a powerful pushback against uh, the military-backed establishment, uh, against nine years of military or military-backed rule. What's been the reaction to Mr. Pryot stepping down, though? Honestly, after the May 14 polls about two months ago, the focus hasn't really been on caretaker Prime Minister Prayut chan -ucha. Instead, the focus shifted to who is going to become the next Prime Minister and whether or not the winning election party of Move Forward parties, Pita Lim Jiren Rudd, will be able to succeed in becoming the 30th Prime Minister for Thailand. However, having said that, obviously, as you mentioned, Prime Minister Prayut chan has been the Premier for nine years and so that elicited a lot of reactions from the citizens on the streets. For example, his supporters in one camp saying obviously they're disappointed. They truly believe that he actually brought about stability to the country. They credited him for his handling of the COVID-19 pandemic as well as continuing to help the country run throughout the nine years. But then on the flip side, you see his naysayers. They actually criticize him and say it is time for him to leave. Nine years is nine years, way too long. And this is the time for the new generation and a new coalition government to take over because they have actually said that he has prevented the country from growing. A military-run government and a military-run administration just did not serve Thailand good at all. And therefore, they say that the hope is next for the incoming government. Obviously, he has credited himself for all the benefits that the country has seen thus far. However, you've got now a new lease of life in an incoming government. However, two days before as well, the next Prime Minister will be voted in and the people are really hoping for a change. ถ้าท่านน่ะลาออกมาก่อนหน้าเนี้ยมันก็จะดีมากกว่านี้เพราะว่ามันจะมันจะได้เร็วขึ้นเนี่ยการเปลี่ยนแปลงมันก็จะเ